Well, I tried and tried and tried to manually create a better, better recipe than uh, spicy five, and I finally came up with spicy apples after a great deal of work. Apples, of all things. So, this is a 13.25. You ready for how much I managed to get? 13.43. Yeah, I know. I, I, adding any more apple or reducing the apple messes it up. No other ingredient works. It has to have a spiciness of at least five. I ended up with a with an eight point nine because that just ended up being about optimum. I don't know. I don't even know what to say. I'm just pouring spices on an apple. Anyway, I've already got this to thirty four, so I'm gonna go with spicy five and see if that makes all the difference. And we will give Erica another chance. Sheer willpower will not be enough to overcome. My gosh, her score. Her chili is just ridiculous. I gotta find out what her recipe is. How did she get a spice dish that was this good? Apparently, I don't know how to make spice dishes. I'm willing to bet the problem is because I'm using salt, pepper, and ginger. That I don't have, you know, chili powder, or paprika, or red cayenne pepper, or... I could go on and on and on. I like to cook with lots of spices. I don't necessarily make hot, spicy dishes with lots of peppers in them or anything, but I do like my spices. And, you know, a little bit can go a long way if you know what you're doing. Really, the spice rack should be like the first thing that a chef works out. Like once you've got potatoes and beef, like you, you, you know, and cheese, like you, you can make a lot of dishes with just a few base ingredients. Uh, you know, of course you want more ingredients, but the spices, they're the most important thing. I mean, anybody can bake a potato, but to know how to spice a potato... That's... Okay, well, nothing to do now. And she just stands by. Do you get a bonus score for standing around? Doesn't seem like it. So why don't you at least try to taunt me or something? And uh, no. No, I... I got nothing. I mean, I really got nothing on this one. Huh. Should I just go for the rebirth? The problem is tripling doesn't seem very good to me. But... Hmm. Hmm. She's going to have a secondary theme. There's a boost in areas with speciality. Uh, hmm. See, I used a uh, part of the problem is I used those two potions on this run, so I expect to do more than you know, more than one added area. Certainly expect to get more than this. I gotta push at least one area deeper to make this run worthwhile. I think really what I just need to do is I need to beat the challengers every hour. I'm gonna need to actually catch them hour upon hour just to get ingredients. If I can get a host of ingredients I can make more recipes and, well, well, you know how it goes from there. So what I should probably do I should probably rig up four pages of recipes, set them all to 40 or something. I've got the money after all, maybe even 50. And uh, just try to do, tr you know, leave it alone and just do the trainers.
I don't think I should pupil up until I at least beat Erica. At least. Uh, aside from research, I don't really have much use for cash. I think that's its one purpose. My research is so slow compared to everything else that I'm not getting nearly enough of it done. So yeah, definitely want to get the researches up. Hmm. Nothing could prevent me from making mistakes or doing something stupid. <laughs> Get that stat as high as you like, it'll still happen! Ah, right, then. Well. Hmm. Right, then. So. <clears throat> I'm gonna do a little bit of feeding. And the results. Yeah, have spicy apples. Okay. And the all-important result is that I can collect this. Da 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 da. Oh, really? You mean I can get potentially It looks like the numbers got harder. But I could potentially collect the same reward multiple times in a week, huh? Oh no, okay, you already received the reward for this week. Never mind. So are these counting towards the next week? They might. Alright. Well, I'm just gonna rip all these open. You know what? I should save them because the money would be useful on my rebirth. I've now got the potions here. Hmm. Okay, what can I do over here? Income. I could take more income. Really, I think these two are the most important. But I want to get this to be a 200%, you know? So we'll just nudge it up a little. We've got eight left. Hmm. Now, none of that is really going to help me much with clearing the area, and I still am beaten five times over last time I checked. <clears throat> so, honestly, I'm not entirely sure how to become five times stronger. Even if I had another pupil who spent as much time as this one had, I'd only be a little more than triple boosted. I've been researching, working my way through stuff, but, you know, a lot of this is just stuff. <laughs> now they've got all these super research recipes. Should be able to do a little bit better. But the big thing that's been going on is that I have been slowly collecting, well, secrets as well, but uh, mostly it's ingredients. We're gathering more and more of them. And in time... In time, we're going to have the ability to make better dishes. But my spices are still stunted. Horribly stunted. And unfortunately, nothing that I have comes naturally spicy yet. Really, what I'm waiting for is the chili pepper. Any kind of pepper, really. Nah. That's why getting past this spicy food one is so hard. 
uh, pouring tons of spices on something just utterly wrecks it. Every recipe I try, every time I try. Always get the same result. Okay, that's the limit on salt. Okay, let's just remove the salt. It's got to have at least five spiciness. Hmm. All right, let's go with this. I could potentially add an ingredient. Okay, that doesn't work. I didn't think it would, but you never know. Okay, meat should help, but it doesn't. Really, this should be able to do something added to it. Even oil is bad. Cheese. Oh ho. Okay, I did find something I could add. As long as it doesn't decrease the spiciness, this still counts as a spicy food. Ah, we'll go with that. <laughs> Chili. Here you go. Okay, okay. Uh, spicy. So I have been able to get a 13 out of spicy apples. Yeah, I know it's weird. This. Chili. Hmm, I don't know. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to really make this bowl of chili to compete with hers. Going to really do this thing. However long it takes. However many millions of dollars it costs. <sighs> However many millions of dollars it costs, we're going to make the most incredible chili, and that is how we're going to claim another restaurant. Unless during that time I pick up, like, chili peppers or something. <laughs> Then I probably won't have any more terrible problems for a while. It's just, just these chili pepper, my need of chili peppers. I like this thing. I like it and its quotes. Hmm. This is a pretty good AFK screen. Honestly, it's got all the things you want to know. <sighs> See. I'm better than the current opponent, but she beats me five times over. And I really think it's because she has ingredients I do not. I'm pretty sure that that's what it's been down to, but, well, we'll see. Maybe this bowl of chili will be what I needed. Should have thought of it sooner. Should have thought, why don't I just make chili? If that's what she's beating me with. <sighs> 
Well, I think maybe, maybe with my new chili and almost 70 levels backing it, we just might be able to take you on, Erica. Look at how quickly I make my chili compared to yours. I'm ahead. Holy crap, I'm ahead. We really did learn how to make it ridiculously fast. And this product is a heck of a lot better than the one I was running before. What was it, spicy number seven? Now oh, this. Your chili soup is no match for the real chili. We don't water ours down. Oh, shoot. Three levels? What the heck? I'm supposed to be the master of trash talk and competitive cooking. You know, we've all, we've all been, we've all seen chef shows. You know, they're always trash talking each other while they cook, right? Yeah, that's totally how it is. I want a cooking battle against Metaton. I bet Metaton would be really tough to beat. <laughs> Alright. I will knock Sophia Strickland's socks off. And the secret Tammy will really love this. Are you related to the boon from uh, Fallout New Vegas, perhaps? Oh well. I'm sure that this person will like it too. Josephine. Really, though, whose first name is Secret? From now on, you're in charge of trash-talking my competition while I cook, because you're ridiculously good at it, Erica. Your force of will is impressive. I won. That was the secret, was getting the correct food. Okay, that was the spicy food. Hmm... And that might be the secret to making correctly spicy food from now on. Dragon Town! It's, uh, it's kind of dangerous here. A lot of people with black suits and sunglasses walk around. Most of them carry a weapon. Uh, I'm sure it's fine. Dragon Town. Well. Let's go back to our park district. Um, uh, well, I mean, okay, hold on. Start exploring. Okay. Now we need to go to our restaurant. Uh, I guess first we need a menu. No, just dump them. Wow. Chili soup is worth a ton, but where is my chili? Why am I selling pancakes? This is what won the competition. You're gonna serve my chili here. I won't allow it any other way. Uh, let me see. I guess I'll hire Annie. Annie Oakley, you're in here now. Hmm. I suppose I really should train these for a while. Hmm. Okay, stop. I don't know what the new area needs. What do they cook? There's an easy way to find out right away. Vegan? Oh, that's what the dragons are into. Yeah, there's no hope. Okay, vegan, vegan. Let me consider, what am I currently running in this area? Well, we've got vegan number 10. The potato chip is currently my best vegan recipe, is it? Ah, okay. Huh. 
Huh. Hmm. But it has a very low quality, I see. Hmm. All right. Well, let's see what the auto create can do. Hmm. Pumpkin, peas, apples, and curcuma. Okay, so far I've seen a oh a sixteen point one six potatoes, pears, and apples. What is it? You just threw potatoes, pears, and apples, some spice into a onto a onto a tray. Okay. All right, 16.75. Can I get a 17? Whoa! Something good! Fruit in ginger. Okay. Delete that. Delete that. Okay. Let's see if I can create something. Hmm. Hmm. Funny how Apple has the highest taste of anything. And ginger. Eggs have a good taste, but we're in vegan land. Nope. I just get a picture of an apple. Oh well. You're going to refuse. It's already at 26. What can I do? You will accept that? It's got to be at least a hundred grams, huh? Okay. This is my ultimate vegan dish. It's called an apple. We are now going to research how to make an apple. Presumably we grow it on a tree. <laughs> Maybe if we sprinkle ginger into the plant's roots every morning. No, that doesn't do anything. Okay, let's try something else. Yeah, okay, whatever. Maybe the ginger apple will be enough. I don't know. We'll let the research do its thing. Okay, we're up to 2,000 here, which is good. Really good. It's not rebirth time yet. <laughs> it's pretty true. You know, I really need one of these things to hang around when I'm working on my novel or my YouTubing. And just just shout out stuff like that or that <laughs> yeah that's also pretty true all right let's see so we are up to 66 on our apple I think we're about ready to go hmm 
We have six minutes, but this is a new category. Where did this come from? Upgrade. That doesn't upgrade your boxing center. What now? Oops. Ah. Is that a rainforest? What in the world am I looking at now? It's like the might tab suddenly unlocked, kind of, only not at all. Good boxing center is the best place to improve your punching power. Uh, I mean speed. You only need speed for getting up food. Ever. No, let's totally go into martial arts. Let's start getting into the cooking and punching people in the face at the same time. Or else the dojo is a better place to improve your accuracy. Nowhere, at least that you know of. Huh. Museum. If you already made a lot of paintings, you really need to show them to the world. And a museum is a good place to do that. It might even help you to improve your imagination. Rainforest has lots of dangerous animals and insects, so it's a good place to improve your survival skills. Uh, and your instincts, of course. Ooh, spice testing center. We might need this, because we don't have, we need more spices before we can get this, right? It's just a huge building to store all your spices. You can go there every day and improve your smelling ability. You need to be able to smell the age and the quality of your spices to prepare the best food. What unlocked this? Doing well, you might have noticed your opponents in the air in the areas in the areas are getting stronger and your training alone might not be enough. Fear not! For the cost of a few pina, I mean dollars, you can upgrade the training facilities to multiply your training effects. It's more like beating what is it? Dionysus? No, wait, Diana? Diana? Or was it Freya? Freya, I think. Anyway, it's just the upgrades. Except that this is to training rather than to monuments. Huh. Sadly, your people lose all your upgrades. So don't spend all your money. Ha ha ha. Okay. So that is a 5% boost. Did it have an effect there? Doesn't look like it did. Hold on. Hmm, not really helping there. But I can afford so many of these. We can do this. Maybe this is what we've been needing all along. Hmm. How long was this open for? How long did I just not notice this? Ooh, okay, maybe not quite that many. Ack. Se 70, not 170. Good grief. Okay. Bonk. Bonk. This is what we've been needing all the money for. So we could do this. Okay, then. Now that we've funded 70 museums, 70, no, I'm sorry, 80 rainforests, and so on and so forth, you receive the title Powerful Cook. Uh, right. Uh, stats page. Where, ah, oh, right, here they are. Powerful Cook. Yes. Shame these titles don't do things. Oh, well. Something I've always wanted in a game. As weird as that is to say, for years I've been thinking about how I wanted to have titles that were equipable like this, except they'd give bonuses. Except I wanted them in weird things, like in Pokemon. Hey, I have weird ideas, okay? Well, this is like the... This is so natural a place to have the bonuses... Have, have those do bonuses of some kind. Like, it is so natural. Anyway, let's see. Um, There is no way you can fight my ginger apple. Like, it is straight up impossible that your salad can beat my ginger apple now. I am so ridiculously powerful now, thanks to the upgrades. Oh my gosh. 
I have a reason to need money in this game. So this should be over quick. Vegans don't want salads. They want apples rolled around in ginger. And you have to cook them just the right amount. Then slice them. Then you stick the slices into a toaster. We've researched this very thoroughly. We know this is the proper way to prepare an apple. A ginger apple. As for the ginger, you have to inject it in small amounts into the apple while it's growing on the tree. It's, it's a very precise process. But the result is the perfect ginger apple. I don't even know what ginger tastes like. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, I like cooking, and there's a lot of things I cook with, but ginger is not one of my ingredients. Oop, you're done. Seven salads, huh? I have enough ginger apples, I can literally bury your salad in it. Hmm. Attention to the appearance and the quality, but only like spicy. Ginger's a spice. Oh my gosh. Okay. Onion! Hey. Quickly, let's buy... Wait, no. First, we need a menu. Whomp. Cappuccino, of course, every time. And pancakes. Let's see. Waiters. Gotta have waiters. Okay. But really... Huh, that office district is doing better now. Hmm. Oh, well, we're moving. Oh, right, a challenger. But we got a new area to Seaside Hill. The houses here are on top of a hill where you can see the sea. A beautiful view. They share the flat with only nine other people. Still nine. Hasn't gotten any better. Can't get it down to sharing with just eight. Oh, well. I'm going to go play around with one of these challengers. They're scaled with me like ultimate beings, and I think that they're the people. They're, they're like my own employees. But, uh, yeah. I just want the ingredients right now, so I'll take on the easy one. They always use my own my own stuff because they work for me, don't they? I don't pay enough attention to all my waitresses and cooks' names, so I don't know. Oh well. Anyway. <sighs> Curry. Hmm. Curry. I do not have a curry. Hmm. All right, let's throw something together. A uh, curry recipe needs at least five different ingredients. Please increase your maximum ingredients. Oh no, I don't know how to put more than four things into a pan at once. Uh, <laughs> it is too complicated for me. I can't figure it out. Crap. Oh, man. Oh. Well. It looks like we don't have a lot of choice now, does it? Hmm. I could wait. The dragon will eventually get it for me. Light Fairy wants to eat a curry dish. 
it to Light Fairy. All right, then. Well, what we're going to have to go with is... Let's just do it. We'll become almost five times as powerful. And then... We'll gather more cooking metals and use it to get that upgrade we need. All right. Oh, what, do they become fully satiated? I mean, there's really, I mean, I don't have... Look, this is my atomic super chili. Okay? Okay. All right. Eh. Eh. <laughs> there we go. A little bit of ambition in that face. Eh, it matches. Hmm. Well, can't have everything you want. No, no, I named you! Yeah, I really gotta debug this thing. <laughs> yes. Okay, okay, whoa, how we already got levels? Where'd those come from? Hmm, no upgrades or anything yet. Okay, yeah, they get pushed immediately up to 100%. I see, alright. Hmm. Well, fine. Left these here. Now everything's back down to level one. Uh, let's not worry about it too much. Please. I have this. Doesn't matter that it's level zero. This is a dish. You're just serving <laughs> apple juice. It's a restaurant that serves nothing but apple juice. You know, you could just have a vending machine that does that. <laughs> well, anyway. Tearing through, gathering our cooking metals, see how far we get. And uh, hopefully, I'll be able to learn the secrets of putting five ingredients in at once so that I can make my curries. You are fast at producing those. What exactly cooking is involved? You make the squeeze the juice and then you you boil it or something? Boil out the water, make it thicker, more syrupy. And then the presentation is critical. You can't just put it in a jar, no. You have to take out your paints and carefully paint the jar till it's perfect. Yeah, anyway. Alright. Right, so... I just barely managed to get the money that I can do a challenge after I knocked out the children's district. So next up we've got Old Town. But first, before we go any further, we need to open, find out what's inside these. Oh, hmm. Cooking metals. Good. One more and we got it. All right. I'm going to go ahead and blow these. I won't get any more for a week, so... Uh, yeah. Hmm. But hey, it's good. Now I come over here to you. Uh, you've got an egg dish of ten. Hmm, I should 
fix this. What's my best egg dish? Hmm. Well, egg number 28 has way better taste. The combination is terrible and the weight is heavy, but whatever. Let's see, it looks like I got all my themes to 10. Good. Next time I work on them, I'll have to carry them further. But I'm a millionaire now. I can afford such things. No, we're not going to have super, super good stakes. We're going to pay equal attention to all things, from vegan to eggs to drinks. Okay. Now... Well, you should be exploring that. Okay. So we'll pick up yet another new ingredient, and more importantly, the last cooking metal. The only thing in our way, standing between us and the power of curry. So, both using the same egg dish, but Ice Lady. One of our judges is the Ice Lady. Ha. Huh. I, I don't really have anything else to say. Okay. Icy Lady. Lissy Queen. Bethany Santos. Didn't I see Bethany Santos once already? Oh well. Ah, I screwed that timing up. Hmm. Hmm. How is she still ahead of me? The stats were ever so slightly better. My recipe should have been slightly better. Hmm. Well, disruption will win the day. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Now that I'm into presentation, and you've only got 10. Whereas I have, uh, I don't know, 16? I think I've only made it as far as 12 out of 30. God, it's going to be a while. Oh, well. We'll get our dragon. Fish. Fish. What? I already had the whole fish. Okay. Well. Well, okay. Well, if you're going to be like that, all right, fine. Oh, it falls under meat, does it? Does it really? Well, I think it would go delightful with an onion and, uh, Oh, what goes with this? I mean, pepper and salt go with everything. Vanilla and chocolate. Yes. Oh, look at that taste. Mmm, mmm, good. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is where it's at. We stuff fish bones into onions. It's brilliant. Chocolate covered fish bones. Chocolate and vanilla. It's brilliant. How far can I carry this? Oops, went too far. There's the problem. Okay. 
Any more vanilla will put us over. We'll find the exact spot. Oop, oop, nope, nope, no. But you can never have too much chocolate, right? Okay. Okay, there it is. There's no image that will do this justice. There's no image that has ever been drawn in the world that will do this justice. So we'll leave the generic one. Oh, theme. It counts as spicy? How does it count as spicy? I think it's a dessert. I guess it counts as a fish. There it is. There you go. Chocolate fish bones. Beautiful. It's perfect. That's what we'll be serving now. Huh? Huh? Add it to the menu. We charge $400 a plate. Because of course we do. Why wouldn't we? Alright. Huh. The next stop is vegetarian, is it? I don't think I can take this one on yet. Ah, uh, what dish? What dish? Cheese salad? Gingered rice. That's what we will hit them with. Yep. Yeah, we got this. Huh. Oh, right. I got all I needed over here. All 16. Should have done this before I made the fish bones. Might want to save a few for challenger battles. Not a bad point. Too bad. I buy this now. There you go, five ingredients. Okay. All right. Very good. Very good. Now, let's make our first curry. Ugh. Uh, try again. I'm pretty sure. Oh, there you go. But, 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 <laughs> Our first curry. Banana curry. Hmm. How about apple? You could try apple curry. Here, I'll try. <laughs> Apples do not combine with fish bones, it tells me. Okay. Oop, no, no more ginger. Uh. That good enough? It's mostly a combination of meat rice or vegetables with a lot of spices you can't combine it's just four spices on one thing 
This isn't a meat or a vegetable. Oops. All right. Too much. Okay. Exactly the right amount of ginger. Exactly the right amount of everything. Okay, there you go. Apple curry. Don't try this at home. Just don't. Just just don't try it. Anything you see here on this show, just don't. They're not good ideas. <laughs> All right. All right. The only question is, can I win in Old Town? Still running the same old cheese salads, are ya? No creativity. Well, I have gingered rice. It's seaweed, rice, and ginger. I'm, uh, I'm not doing so hot. I'm, uh, gonna lose this one. By a large margin. <laughs> oh, well. We'll see how this turns out. He's a thousand points ahead right now. But it's really impossible for me to tell, because of all the variables, how this is going to turn out. Okay, a, barely a win. Okay, then. Ah, Mendy. Mendy will be the spot that you have to stop at. You can't take her on. You know that you can't take her on. All right, let's see. Ch -ch 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 staff. Higher. 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 And higher. Okay, now that we have a uh, cooking metal again, I can do chat. I can take on challengers once more. Hmm. Don't know how I unlock that upgrades tab. She's not going to tell me. <laughs> not sure what triggered that, but oh well. Inevitably it will come up again, no doubt. Alright. So. What I should probably do is set up a ton of recipes, all at 50. And let it spend the night going through them all. really afford to do that. Alternately, another thing I could think about doing is setting my staff up to train in all my restaurants, leaving the single mandatory cook in each. Hmm. And in this way... You can see I did had oh left that one training. Oops. Oh well, Charlene Holland is a really awesome waitress, apparently. Go go Charlene. So yeah, by doing this I can let them really build up. But then I won't have my oops. This chef has been really working and really working out, man. As they slowly get more expensive, I'm still profitable. Hmm. 
Alternately, I could have them just run on the themes. Am I losing money? No, I'm still gaining, but I'm also only on 11. When it gets up to 50, it'll get slow. Hmm. And then I could put one there, and since I can have up to two active, well, all I need to do, I wish you would tell me, uh, I wish you'd tell me how many restaurants are serving each of these right now. Guess the total sales button does that. Yeah. So I can run through. I can put one on. I guess what I'll do is I'll set them to 30. It's probably higher than they'll ever reach anyway. Pancakes. They sell like hotcakes. Oh, wait. <laughs> Oops, bread. Oh, well, it's somebody selling it. Fish soup. Okay. The all important cappuccino. I should probably make that one go to 50. Definitely make that one go to 50. I mean, good grief. Every place sells it. Definitely. It's the beverage to rule them all. Okay, let's see. So, we sell onigiri. We sell... Fruit plates. I haven't been giving fruit enough attention. We do sell chicken legs. Hmm. Some of these things are going to sell just in restaurants I haven't gotten dominion over yet. Poultry number 33. The 50s on that one. Hmm, must have been from a previous iteration. Must have been a leftover from the last master. But this master chef has a has different ideas. Fruit number eight. I really should think about my fruit. I bet I could make really good ones now. I should probably think about making more drinks. Vegan 10. Uh-oh, we're almost out of slots. I wonder if I can get more of them. The chocolate cherry. Oh, nobody eats meat poop. What's wrong with meat poop? Why don't people find it appetizing? People like my chocolate fish bones. <laughs> All right, looks like that's everything that's actually being sold currently. Now, we're gonna want the curry because eventually that's gonna be what we battle with. And we're going to want spicy is going to end up being a thing. Hmm. So those two are going to be critical. I don't think there's any way this is going to make it through all of them in the night. But I suppose it could happen. So for that reason, the last one gets left as zeros.
Yeah, you can just go till I run out of my 50 is good enough for you. 50 is fine. Okay, everything's locked down, so I won't make a lot of profits. I'm actually losing money already. Hmm. But yeah, when I turn these all on, suddenly we'll make tons of money. We can set all of our restaurants to advertise, and we can set them all to have, uh, we can customize them all s as much as possible. And hopefully this will open up, and I'll be able to do that again with all the upgrades. Already, how long it, have you been at this? Almost no time at all, and already you're matching the original guy that had two weeks. with your retire bonus at least all right we're in good shape I think real good shape hmm even as we slowly bleed money we get better thanks to the researches and as his skill rises as a chef the restaurant he works at personally gets improved. Yeah. So, I think we're going to have a very effective night. Hmm. The goal should be out of reach, but not out of sight. I try to calculate how long this would last me, but I know that it's going to be variable because every time they finish, like when this hits 50, like it's going to get more and more and more expensive. Then it's going to go here and it's going to become less expensive again. And the same thing will be happening with these recipes over here. So it's really hard to calculate. Also, as they, you know, these places that sell these various items will be more profitable thanks to these levels. So entirely possible it'll reach an equilibrium at some point hmm. could always throw a throw one of my pets in as a mascot but nah